Niles, Executive Director, and Carly Starr, Brulo Niles, Co-Programming and Creative Director of the Oceanside International Film Festival, are here to talk about film. Welcome. Thanks for having us. Yeah, very excited. <laughs> Happy to have you here. Excited that you're going to share about the very important OIFF, a film festival that's huge on the film circuit, a big deal in Oceanside. Tell us about it. Yes. Um, well, our 12th running we'll yeah. be having in February, uh, February 21st through 25th. It's okay. a Tuesday night through uh, Saturday night with all kinds of great films from all around the world. Yeah. Uh, we're very excited to be presenting. Absolutely. And tell us a little bit about the films, Carly. What, what might we expect? Well, it's awesome to receive films as an international film festival. Absolutely. Because you get to see the state of the world. And usually when you're a filmmaker, uh, sometimes you have a lot of reflection. Yeah. So this year's reflection and anticipation has been focused mainly around mental health wow. and self-discovery. And many of our films are outdoors. Uh, many of our films are documentary. So we, Sterling Anno is the co-programmer along with me. Wow. And we sift through hundreds of films that we've been receiving all over the world. And it's been a wonderful thing to see after the pandemic, what people have come out with their own self-discovery. So I think the films this year in 2023 really reflect um, what we have going on. Yeah, a really insightful take on where we're oh, at yes, as yes. a community. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And, and opening night yeah. is a is a whole different ball game, isn't it, Lou? <laughs> yeah. Tell um, us, what's opening night? So we're really night? excited about uh, opening night, which will be yeah. Tuesday, February 21st. Um, we are presenting the world premiere of a film called I Am All Right, um, directed by Krista Linney. It features the silent comedy, um, an extremely popular and legendary local band from San Diego um, that was rising to stardom and then poof, kind of disappeared um, and really didn't have any explanations. So this film is going to explain what happened. Um, there was some, you know, mental wellness yeah. issues uh, yeah. happened, yeah. and they had to take some time off. And so uh, we're fortunate to be able to present that film. Wow. Uh, the band um, will be present uh, along with the director, and then the band will do a Q&A after the film and uh, perform a few songs semi-acoustic uh, as they get ready to kick off their new tour uh, coming this spring. Wow, what an amazing event. Yeah. So, partnering film with music. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. awesome. That's what's unique about the festival is every year yeah. we usually have interesting events, you know. And with Lou's background in music, uh, it's yeah. always taken a fun turn, you know. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, this year is exciting. It, it goes well with Fat Tuesday. <laughs> so, we think that people can come to the Brooks and experience that. And then on Wednesday, we have short blocks. Uh, many local filmmakers on this one. It's kind yeah. of fun and exciting. Uh, we have a couple from Oceanside. And then we have Publish or Perish, which is a feature film from LA. And the director and a few actors are coming down. And they just got international distribution. And it's their world premiere. And Thursday, we're pretty excited. Uh, there's a feature doc called The Mirage with uh, super runner Timothy Olson. So hopefully the turkey trot people, <laughs> we've been talking to a lot of local running groups. Yeah. Uh, he's a world famous runner and it's a beautiful documentary and we're kind of excited. Uh, he may be a, attending the festival as well. A lot of different types of films that yeah. people can experience. Yeah. yeah. So how do we buy tickets? How do yeah. we get involved? Uh, Osidefilm.org okay. is the place to go. Uh, for all the tickets, we've got uh, separate tickets for a couple special events. The opening night is a separate ticket. Um, we're doing the, a premiere of a, a big feature film called Big Wave Guardians. It's about um, the Hawaiian uh, water patrol and lifeguards in Hawaii and the really dangerous surf uh, and waves and ocean out there. Yeah. Um, so we're really excited to present that. Um, the Surf Museum will do a little pre-reception for that on Friday night. Yeah. And then um, we have a special one-on-one -on -one and the award ceremony on Saturday night. But you can buy tickets for each day okay. and go see all the blocks that day or buy the all, all block festival pass, which allows you to go to um, all the blocks on Wednesday, Thursday, and Saturday. All right, so people can go ahead and buy their tickets, yeah. participate. Really a film for everyone with this event, right? It's true. Yeah. If you go to... Yeah. 
If you go to our website, all the films are listed with their thesis and their log line, and it, it's, it's pretty nicely laid out. And all over town, you'll start seeing the posters of, of the schedule for the week. Amazing. Yep. Such an amazing event for Oceanside. We're so grateful to have the film festival yeah. and to have you two at the helm. Yeah, yeah. thank you. Great, thanks. Yeah. So it takes a team. <laughs> <laughs>